now that we have the XML sitemap in hand, let's talk about submitting that to the Google Webmaster Tools. And the reason why you want to do this is it'll get your site indexed, your pages indexed into Google much faster. And then, of course, that gives you better organic ranking. So that's the reasoning behind all of this. So what I recommend that you do is go to Google.com, type in Google Webmaster Tools, that way you don't have to remember the link, and this is it right here. So if we go ahead and click on it, you'll need a Google account to log in, of course. And up at the top, you're going to notice that these are your existing sites that have been submitted, but you're gonna notice a big red button that says add a site. So go ahead and click that. And you wanna go ahead and enter your URL here. And once you have done that, you're gonna get this page and Google is going to want to verify that you're actually the owner of that site. So in order to do this, you will need to follow the instructions. So basically this consists of downloading an HTML verification file, uploading it to your website, wherever you have verified it, and then simply confirm successful uploading by visiting this link. And then of course, after that is done, you can click verify down below. So it's really easy as long as you have access to your website. If you don't, you'll need to contact your webmaster and do it. And I'm going to download this file and upload it to that location. So I'm gonna pause this video and do that real quick. Okay, so I went ahead and did that through cPanel and you can go to your cPanel and you can go to file manager as well or you can go through FileZilla FTP, it's up to you. There are many different routes to do it. But basically you want to go to that link in number three after you've uploaded it and you're gonna see something like this. And then of course, after we're done, we're gonna click on verify and it says congratulations, you have successfully verified your ownership of blah, so your website. Click continue and next you're going to see this page and what you wanna do is you want to select the crawl and it's going to drop down this stuff here. You're gonna click on sitemaps and then it says add slash test a sitemap. So what we can do here is add the sitemap name. So in this case, I'm gonna go back to my website where the XML sitemap is located and what you want to do particularly is to get the URL up at the top. So when you clicked the XML sitemap here, you're going to be forwarded to this page. What you want to do is get this right here. So remember, it already has this information. So all you need is the file name, which is sitemap underscore index dot XML. Okay, so now we need to paste that here. We can click on test sitemap just to make sure that it works and it does, great. So what we wanna do is we want to submit the sitemap. So when we click submit sitemap, click refresh the page, we can see that it is pending. So now all you have to do is simply wait and Google will basically go and check out your sitemaps and so forth. Now you can also add these other ones if you'd like to. So I get the page sitemap here. So I could add that. And as you can see, it's pending. And remember, we only have three pages. So we've submitted three pages. And you can also check back later and it will actually tell you if it has been indexed. So that's how to submit an XML sitemap to the Google Webmaster Tools.